The WikiLeaks published a press release and a set of documents on Saturday claiming it has evidence to prove that the United States National Security Agency, NSA, spied on phone conversations of Brazilian President Dilma Rousseff and several other high-ranking government officials. The press release by the group said, the publication proves that not only President Dilma Rousseff was targeted but also her assistant, her secretary, her chief of staff, her palace office and even the phone in her presidential jet. The group published a list of 29 phone numbers that is claimed to be belonging to high-level Brazilian officials targeted by the NSA. WikiLeaks documents release came just three days after Rousseff visited the U.S. President Barack Obama in the White House, two years after her trip's originally scheduled date. Brazilian leader cancelled her visit to the U.S. in 2013 after former NSA contractor Edward Snowden revealed her communications were spied on by the U.S. In the press release, WikiLeaks editor-in-chief Julian Assange said, our publication today shows the U.S. has a long way to go to prove its dragnet surveillance on friendly governments is over. It is not the first time the WikiLeaks is publishing documents claiming the U.S. spying on its allies. The United States spied on German Chancellor Angela Merkel and several ministers from her cabinet, WikiLeaks said on Wednesday. The whistleblower group published another set of documents on June 23 saying that the U.S. spied on three latest French presidents, Presidents François Hollande, 2012, present, Nicolas Sarkozy, 2007-2012, and Jacques Chirac, 1995-2007, as well as many other high-ranking French government officials. WikiLeaks also claimed to have obtained more than 250,000 messages between the U.S. State Department and American diplomatic missions overseas. Julian Assange took refuge in Ecuadorian embassy in London since June 2012 as he faces sexual abuse charges in Sweden, which he claimed to be politically motivated. If handed over to Swedish authorities, Assange can then be extradited to the US, where he could be tried over WikiLeaks publications.